Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and thank you guys so much for joining me for today's video. As you guys know, recently I've been playing around with the type of videos that I share, having fun, and for today I decided to share with you guys what a... I don't know what to call it maybe like a girl's day or self-care day looks like now I know that we can all get stuck in the routine of just life and just having to keep up with our homes having to clean up having to just do everything that requires our attention and well that's important too and I know it's easier said than done it's also important to just give ourselves some time to do the stuff that we enjoy doing. So while I did get the house cleaned and picked up this morning, I'm freeing up my afternoon to just do some stuff that I want to get done. I'm going to go get my nails done, going to go get a pedicure with my sister. I want to go to Target, Hobby Lobby, see if I find any home decor. I haven't been home decor shopping in so long, so I I'm feeling up to it. I'm feeling like I want to go out and see what's out there see if I can get inspired to decorate for spring slash Easter and so on so that is what we're gonna do today as always if you guys enjoy this video please give me a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe as you guys could expect we have like Easter and spring decorating videos coming up hopefully soon we will see where today takes us but yes I hope you guys enjoy it and let's go ahead and get into this self-care day routine Okay friends, the first thing I like to do on days like today so I can truly enjoy my me time is a good crock pot dinner. So this way I don't have to worry or stress about coming home early enough to make dinner. I know it's taken care of. So today I made a tomato basil chicken spaghetti. I've shared this recipe before but I will go ahead and leave the ingredients and the measurements down below in the description box for you guys but honestly it is so easy you more than likely have all the ingredients in your pantry right now and it's super delicious so I'm just gonna go ahead and make sure I leave this cooking before I head out and yeah that way I can just truly enjoy the time that I'm out shopping that I'm out with my sister and so on I'm sure you guys feel the same way but crock pot recipes are honestly just amazing on days like today Drives me crazy Okay friends, so I made my way to Hobby Lobby and I am showing you guys just a few clips of some of my favorite items. There is definitely a lot to choose from so head on over to your Hobby Lobby and just look around. Honestly, sometimes just walking around even if you don't purchase anything can inspire you to use or repurpose decor you already have at home. So today I did manage to find a few things but again, I'm just showing you guys items i truly loved and i would pick up for my own decor but you guys already know i have a lot and i'm into using what i already have so i didn't pick up too much but i will share with you guys in a haul in just a minute Okay friends, I am back. I did get a chance to go to Hobby Lobby finally and it was really nice to just walk around and see everything that they have new. But I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I feel like their prices are a little bit up there even after the discount. I don't know if you guys have noticed that as well, but I feel, I'm not 100% sure, I feel that they increased their prices. So. Definitely let me know down below in the comments what you guys think. Some of the things I still think are definitely worth it, but others 
I just think are a little bit too pricey. But anyways, I want to show you guys the few pieces I picked up for my spring and Easter decorating. I actually... Now there's a few pieces. I did go to Target and picked up something there and Walmart. I just didn't film because I went in for other stuff. Not necessarily going to purchase decor, but walked out with a few things. Anyways, the one thing I do think Hobby Lobby has a lot of and for good prices as of right now is all of their wooden like cooking utensils or kitchen stuff. So I picked up this cute little scoop right here. It is just this little scoop it's wooden for $10.99 so again you see what I mean like $11 regular price for this I just think that that's so much but after the 40% off I guess it's about six dollars six something so it's fine but I still think it's a little bit pricey anyways I picked this up you guys know I love decorating with little wooden touches and for Easter that's what I want to do so this can really go anywhere you can actually use it as a scoop inside of a canister or you can use it as decor which is what I'm gonna do next up I already have one of these but I picked up another just in case because I always end up needing two of something but it is just this cute little mini cutting board this was a $7.99 and it was 40% off everything was 40% off let's just get that out of the way but I grabbed this specifically because I saw these and I thought it was so cool that they are selling these little glass enclosures or clo I think how do you pronounce it cloche I don't know but um this was $9.99 and I just thought this would be so cute on top of this like this you guys know I collect the cake stands I think I have three so far but this is such a good mini one and yeah they, they sell these individually so you can get as many as you need and you can actually layer them on top of like anything if, even if you don't have like a little wooden cutting board you can just use this but anyways that is what I got it for and I think it's really cute of course this is probably going to be on my coffee bar shelf so we shall see next up I got this cute little berry dish I have so many berry dishes it's kind of funny but I just love them I think they're such a good uh staple decor piece for spring and summer just all these like hot months I, I don't know i just think that they go really well and this one was so cute and it was priced at 10.99 which for this i think it's a good price and i just love it it's just this very simple white one they did have a pink one as well but i figured there's a lot of pieces you can pick up to work throughout the season so this can work throughout like you know spring summer even going into fall Oops, sorry, that was my phone. Um, so I'm trying to pick up pieces that I can use for more than one season, hence why I picked something in that white color. Anyways, last and final piece. This was so cute and I kind of debated picking it up because I wasn't sure where I want my Easter decor, like in what direction I want it. But when I saw it, I just thought it was so cute. And I think it's gonna work with a lot of the pieces I used for like my Valentine's Day decorate with me and a lot of those same colors. But it was a little bit pricey. But anyways, I absolutely love this cute little bunny set. I don't know, figure. It's the little like male and the female with the cute little carrots. I love that the carrots are such like a muted tone. So it's not a super bright orange or super bright green. So it'll work perfect for like a neutral decorate with me or if I want to add color as you guys know is what I'm going to do. I always love incorporating all the colors during spring and Easter, but I do want to do like a neutral decorate with me at least in my coffee area so that this was perfect this was a 28.99 so this is what i'm saying i think things are a little bit pricier than they used to be i don't know why i thought this would be maybe like 19.99 plus the 40 percent off but yeah 28.99 is a little bit up there for what i'm used to from hobby lobby but anyways i thought it was worth it it's so cute and i had to pick it up Next up, I just grabbed something random from Walmart. It is just this cute little ceramic egg holder in this beautiful green color. 
so so practical such a cute little piece of decor this was five dollars part of their dollar spot that they have now so got that and from target's dollar spot i grabbed this cute little platter i don't know what to call it but it just has these cute carrots adorable so i don't say cute so many more times it's adorable and as you guys can see i kind of have a theme going on i really like this green for easter it also goes really well with the little bunnies right here you see do you guys see my vision can you guys kind of pick it up but anyways that is everything i picked up today and i think that's everything i am gonna pick up for easter i still have to go through my easter decor bin and just pick out what i am gonna use and what Ever I'm gonna donate or put into my yard sale so yeah I think I'm gonna go with a much more minimal Easter in your face but I still wanted some bunnies here and there I still want the feeling of spring but like I did with my Valentine's decor I want to be able to leave it up for longer than just that holiday so for example my Valentine's decor is still up even though we're almost done with February I just love it and it works so that's what i want to accomplish for easter but it is almost time for me to head out for my nail appointment with my sister i asked her if she wanted coffee and she said yes so i'm gonna hurry up and make myself something quick to eat and then head on, on head on over for some coffee and then to meet with her so again i hope you guys are enjoying this video so far and let's go ahead and go grab some coffee I know I might be headed for teardrops Now that you got me started I just can't stop No, no Cause I love you, baby I can't let you go, baby I gotta tell you Okay, friends, I am back home And this is how I did my nails So just plain and simple I'm a simple Jane Just got the, like, acrylic color that they use And almond shape and that is it and then here are my toesies they are just a hot pink but yeah i'm gonna finish dinner and jonathan is right here he's working still it's like seven already but i'm gonna finish dinner and yeah Okay friends, I am back home now and I went ahead and just put some water to boil and now I'm shredding the chicken that has been cooking while I was gone and I just quickly wanted to say how much I enjoy my pedicure and manicure time. On this specific day, only my oldest sister was able to make it but sometimes it's my youngest sister as well and sometimes even my mom will join in and it is just such nice girl time. I absolutely enjoy it I think I do it more for hanging out with them than I do for the actual like pedicure and manicure even though I love it but yeah it was just such a neat time and I love carving out the space and time to do it with them so yeah definitely I encourage you guys to do something similar but anyways back to dinner I'm just putting my spaghetti to cook you can use any pasta you want to be honest and once it's cooked I'm adding it to my crock pot before moving on to making my garlic bread and then we'll be having dinner of course For my garlic bread, I just add some butter, some salt, garlic powder, and some oregano, and that is it. I put this in the oven, and I just take it out once I see that it has toasted 
today it toasted a little bit too much but it was still really good um but yeah that is everything for dinner and that is mostly my girls a day of course one other thing i love doing is just sitting down and having a meal with jonathan which you guys will see in a bit Okay friends, it is finally time to sit down and have dinner. One of my favorite ways to have dinner is in the living room, on the coffee table, sitting down on the floor while watching a TV show. We hardly ever watch TV, so when we do, it is this time. And while it is our time because I'm hanging out with Jonathan, it is just I consider it my time as well because it's something that I enjoy doing. As you guys saw, Jonathan was still working for a bit, but then he puts the computer down and we enjoy dinner together. We enjoy our show together. And then it is time to just get ready for bed. I'm quickly showing you guys some of the stuff I use in the shower, but let me know if you guys would like more of a detailed nighttime routine where I can go into depth on the products I use and so on, just my routine. But that is all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know down below in the comments what you guys thought. And as always, don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!